Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. What a joy to be here together today for the purpose of centering our hearts and our lives on the things of God. And especially today to come together to celebrate Holy <coughs> Communion. Just a few announcements. First, I want to point out to you the beautiful red rose bud over there representing the birth of Luke Daniel Banks, who was born uh, this past Monday. Uh, Sophie and, and Dad, Zach, were here at the 9 o'clock service. They look pretty good. I'm not, and they tell me that Jennifer's doing well, but they're delighted to have, of course, Luke here in a healthy fashion. Also, the other flowers you see here are to celebrate the birthday of Brian Rawhurst, and we certainly want to give thanks for his life as well today. Uh, just a couple announcements. One, just a reminder, it's in your uh, bulletin about the blood drive two weeks from today on the 17th. If you haven't been a part of that in the past, all you have to do is, is pick up the phone and give a call. Uh, our men sponsor this, and they do a great job, and hope you'll be a part of that. Also, uh, as you see in the bulletin, there are luminaires to, that will be sold after worship today to honor folks for the Relay for Life. And also, I want to mention that in the bulletin, there's a Indication there about uh, Bellagio's is having a, on Thursday of this week, uh, if you go and dine there, uh, that certain portion of the of the, fund, of the monies there will go to support uh, the women who go to walk for breast cancer in, in the next few months. So I know many of you eat there because I see you there some, so if you just want to schedule that for Thursday, that would be great. Also, and this afternoon at 2 o'clock, our church council will be meeting and hope that you will, uh, that all of you who are a part of that will be there. If you would just like to come, and these meetings are open, and you'd just like to come and, and share in that event, we invite you to do that as well. Today, as we celebrate Holy Communion, as is our tradition, uh, you're welcome to bring your, any monies that are left here at the altar, go to North, North Buncombe Samaritan Ministries to support that ministry there, and I hope that you will be a part of that, if, you, if that's part of your tradition as you celebrate Holy Communion. If you're visiting with us, we hope you feel very, very welcome already. And as you come to be a part of us today, we feel blessed by your presence. If we can help you in any way, please just give us a call at the church office. And we hope that at the Friendship Pass or Pass that you'll give us either an address or a phone number so that we can be in contact with you. So just to see if there are any ways that we can help you. What a joy it is to be here today. Let us pray. Dear gracious God, sometimes it's easy to come to this place and worship. Sometimes when we perhaps have gone through a week that has beaten us down, we actually look forward to coming here, realizing that you, above all else, know who we are. You know our hurts, you know our pain, but you also know our joys and our celebrations. For whatever reasons we come here today, may we focus on you and allow your love to embrace us and overwhelm us in a way that will bring us from this place closer and closer to you above all else. So hear our prayers, hear our songs, and we celebrate your presence here, especially in this holy meal, as we gather as your children today and ask that you will lead us in all things we pray. Amen.